His house was like a lab in the basement, and, and he was definitely a scientist. Um, he had records lined up all around the walls. Go up to the turntable and stack of records, put the headphones on, and he go through some joints, do needle drops, whatever, find some shit, and he take the headphones off. And he just started nodding, and you could just see the whole shit forming in his head. You know what I'm saying? The joint, he had the joint done before the MP was even turned on. Well, like, I mean, I got all that shit. You know, right. Can, uh, that shit, I just want to get something for the phone to be something else. For the, for the what? Just for the bass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because I want, I want to take it somewhere else, too. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But I'm here with a lot of this atmosphere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We would go there and, um, man, I just remember him taking, going through the records. He would sit there. Sometimes he'd keep the headphones on before, you know, while he would make it. And then, to, you know, you, so you could hear it. And then he'd have it cooked up and he'd just pump it. You'd be like, oh, man, what is this? You go, you know, you just go crazy over the music. You'd be like, damn. We were like nine chompers. And that's when I learned that song, Nine Chompers. It's dope to look back on it. started here. The light, the light was the first song. And Nine Chompers was them two. And that's where it started for this album. And the thing that cats gotta understand is why Jay's the best producer of all time. It's one of many reasons that Jay is the best producer of all time in hip hop. Of all time. 15, 20 minutes. Bro. What can you do in 15 minutes? Find your motherfucking sample? You know what I'm saying? The beat is done already, and it's the best shit you've ever heard in your life.